Hello friends, welcome back to Evel's Tech. Uh, have you ever wondered what if you could simply create an RDP shortcut to your frequently accessed VMs and then access them with just a matter of click without opening Hyper-V Management Console? Well, yes, that is possible. The remote desktop application in Windows has a great feature where you can save all of your custom settings for a specific remote computer to a single RDP file and then just use that RDP file as a shortcut to connect to that remote computer instantly, in our case, virtual machine. However, the VM Connect, uh, the application that is used to connect to the console session of the Hyper-V virtual machine, doesn't have that option. So what to do in this case? Well, if your VM is running Windows, you could always remote desktop directly into the guest OS but that won't connect you directly to the console. But there's a workaround. We can use vmconnect.exe to specify the name of the Hyper-V server and the name of the VM that you want to connect on the command line. So I have a Hyper-V server named localhost and a VM named Windows 7 that I want to connect or use frequently. To do this, all I need to do is to create a shortcut that points to the VM connect.exe with the following syntax. C Windows System32 VM connect.exe, then the server name and then the name of your virtual machine. Do not forget to use the quotes around the VM if it contains spaces. Also, as the VM exists on the same machine as the Hyper-V server where you are creating the shortcut, you can use the name localhost for the server instead of specifying the real name of the server. Once done, click next, name the shortcut whatever you want. In my case, it is Windows 7 and then click finish. The shortcut appears on your desktop. Right click the shortcut and open as administrator to directly open your virtual machine. Isn't that simple? Yes. So that is how you can create shortcut and access virtual machines in case if you have large list of VMs. Okay. Alright friends, um, I hope you find this helpful. If yes, please hit like and do subscribe. Thank you for watching the video and have a great time ahead. Goodbye.